mind wants to do something and heart wants to do something else mind always looks towards to comfy or comfortable situations you need courage to follow the heart when i had to ask you a question what is your name you immediately gave me the answer my name is so and so but if you have to give me a wrong name you'll have to think and then come up with a name and what happens at that time to your heart it starts pumping faster and becomes heavier if you have to lie to your mother what happens to your heart at that time though you may have told the lie for whatever reason your heart will always reflect that heaviness it will undergo some sort of tension but when you have to simply say the right thing mommy i went to this place it's nothing wrong with it when you have to say your name correctly to someone while introducing nothing wrong with it answer just comes like that and there is no repercussions when we have to solve some problems in life then we refer to the heart most of the time but before that mind has already chosen something something pleasant something very easier something uh, that would not take much efforts mind always looks towards to comfy or comfortable situations heart is not worried about all these things heart is always looking for what is right at the moment so when the conflict arises it is because mind wants to do something and heart wants to do something else precisely when something goes wrong when things become unnatural when there is asatya untruthfulness heart speaks louder whenever there is a conflict it is because of this mismatch between heart and mind so always follow the heart there is nothing very special about how to make a decision everyone knows this in it courage to follow the heart when our attention is inward and always seeking answers from within of course we get a lot of information from outside we have this analysis inside we contemplate based on this feedback and then heart makes the final call for it say those are the best decisions even simple things like after 12th grade which course should i take academically having graduated and got my degree what should i do next having completed my education which company to join and secure a job whom to marry all these critical decisions become very easy when we are seeking the help from within as we develop more and more confidence from very early age in making decisions to the help of the heart i think even more difficult decisions will become very i would say playful life becomes joyous